Good morning, everybody. Today, I want to show you a video on how you can create buttons in Secure CRT to do repetitive tasks or base setups. So what we have here is a router at the first screen. No, we don't want to do the auto config. Let this load up a little bit. And the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your view and make sure you have the button bar turned on. So here we are at the initial, you know, prompt of the router. And I'll click this button. Boom. We have a nice setup for a lab environment. We've got the no IP domain lookup no exact timeout, logging synchronous, and then we set the host name all in one click of a button. So let's look at what we're doing here. First thing you would do is right click down in this little area, do new button, and this is where you're gonna type your commands. Then you have a few options. You have uh, backslash R, which basically presses enter for you. So whatever you can think of, you can do. Uh, I have a couple here for do like show IP interface brief. So you can do show I, you know, just saves a couple seconds typing. Um, what this button that I used in the beginning does is basically it's meant to be used from the initial login to the device and you go into enable mode, press enter, type com T, press enter, no IP domain lookup, enter, line con, enter, exact timeout, zero, zero, enter, logging synchronous, enter, exit, and then it leaves you with host name typed in the line and you can set your own host name. So I'm sure you can think of a lot of uses for this. Let me know what you come up with, and I hope I've saved you some time. Thanks for watching.